Hey everybody, I'm Shane from Admin Arsenal. This is Jeremy from Policy Pack and GP Answers. Now um, we're going to extend this video series. We're going to deploy Firefox and then manage the heck out of it. That's what I love. So in PDQ deploy, I'm going to go to the package library. Let's just type in Firefox here, quick filter. And we're going to grab, uh, we'll grab the Firefox 4601. Nice. And then we're going to deploy this. Did, to, you, did to, you get internet connections fast enough here? That was like one second to download 42 <laughs> megabytes. <laughs> and now it's copying the files to your repository. And then we're going to go just deploy this. You want us to do it to computer one, computer two again, right? Let's do it to computer one and computer two. Why not? All right. So there is Firefox. We'll hit deploy. Perfect. And uh, hit deploy. And let's go over here. Let's see it happen in real time. So I'm, I should, again, magically just see the Firefox icon. Actually, here. in this one, we, uh, in this package that we're using, we, we remove uh, the Firefox icon. Okay. Mm -hmm. But if you want, nothing up our sleeves. No. You can go check the uh, control panel. Okay. If you want to see that it is, in fact, installed. Or okay. you can obviously go to the start, start menu. Start okay, menu. Great. It'll be right there. All right. So, so it's, a, it's we got a couple of steps here. Okay. Yeah, it's uh, currently... Running step okay. four of eight. All right. So it'll just, it's just rocking and, rocking and rolling. Now, one thing we do, we also just put a base set of policies down. Um, obviously, you know how they, how they yes. have their policies. Yep. So, uh, but, be, the, but of course, the thing is, once you put them down, there's nothing that says a user can't drift away from that, right? Correct. So it's great to have stuff that's in the package for deployment, but to keep it fully managed over the long haul, that's where we're going to come in. I'm going to move this over to you, sir. Okay. That's it? We're done? Yeah. That was so fast. I can't, let's, let's see if that's, let's see if you're accurate. Oh my gosh, you're so accurate. There it is. So we'll run Firefox. Let's take a look and who cares about this first time stuff. We'll just click through, make sure it's actually working. And let's do a little before and after. We'll go to say the tools options. Uh, we call that the hamburger menu, by the way. Oh, okay. And if you, uh, maybe we can set the home page, and maybe for security, maybe, what if a user were to uncheck these three checkboxes? Would you consider that secure or unsecure? I, I, for my environment? Yeah. That's a, a, an improvement. An improvement, <laughs> right? Yeah, you don't want your users doing that stuff, of no. course. No, and if a user does that, a user unchecks those checkboxes, that's it, man. They, they've made your world less secure. So what we want to do is just prove that we're going to deliver those things and awesome. lock those suckers down so users can't work around it. Okay. So let's go over to our management station, which is over here. We're going to go to our um, Deadwood workstations, and we're going to go to our standard computers. We're going to create a new GPO here and call it Manage the Heck Out of Firefox with Policy Pack. How's that for a name? How's that for typing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm used to Lex. He's, he, he pecks. It takes him 17 minutes just to get that out. So we'll go to computer side, policy pack. We'll go to application settings manager. And we can do a lot in Firefox. A lot of times people come to us because they want to manage the certificates in Firefox. They want to manage the bookmarks in Firefox. We're just going to go right for things that we can just touch really quick. But we can just do just about darn near everything. So if we go to the home page here, we'll go to policypack.com. And we'll right click on this thing. And we will lock down this setting using the system-wide config file. We'll go over, also over to security. And we'll check all these three check boxes. Because we said if, we, if a user has the ability to work around these settings, you're in the doghouse. And you house. double clicked on it. You basically you want to see the underline. Yeah, underline means go in mm -hmm. policy pack land. So if you decide you don't want to do something anymore, it's as simple as that, but we're going to go ahead and lock it down. And that's all there is to it. There's a billion things you could do here to really manage the heck out of Firefox, but we're done. That's it. Let's go over to our um, management station. We'll go ahead and run GP update here. Okay, we'll wait for this to finish. You know, Firefox is one that our customers constantly are asking, how can we uh, have a, a four set of policies, yep. and we love to say policy pack. Policy pack's the way to go. Well, let's go ahead and take a look. We'll just go right back over to Firefox. Go back over to the hamburger menu, also called the Australias. And there we go. <laughs> There's the home page, all locked down, beautiful. And if we go to security, all locked down, users can't work around it. You want to mm -hmm. remove sync, you want to do uh, certificates, we are the way to do just about everything in Firefox. So deploy it with those guys, manage it with us guys. Rock on. Hey, everybody, we'll see you at the next video. Next video.